everybody, it's Claudia. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new and have not seen me before, hello, welcome. I, like I said, am Claudia. And if you're new, that means you're not subscribed and I think you should subscribe. Become part of the hashtag ClaudiatorFam. The button is right down there. I would be so excited if you subscribed and came and joined our little family. But as you can see by the title below, I have a Valentine's Day makeup tutorial and giveaway for you guys today. If you did not see my last video, that is where I go over the whole Valentine's Day giveaway. It will be linked at the end of this video. It's also linked in the down bar so if you'd like to stick around for the tutorial I would be very happy if you stuck around for the tutorial It will be linked at the end of the video, but I'm giving away these goodies for you It's the Too Faced Love Flush Blush Palette. So all six of the Love Flush blushes you get, which is an amazing little palette You are going to get the Strawberry Melted Liquid Lipstick and a Chocolate Soleil Bronzer all from Too Faced So like I said, that's in the other video, but today I'm going to be showing you how to get this look on my face. I do use mostly Too Faced products. I tried to make it a whole Too Faced tutorial, but I realized my Better Than Sex mascara got rid of a few weeks ago, and then I also got rid of my Too Faced shadow insurance, which is an eyeshadow primer that I do really like, but um, I haven't bought in a while, so. And then brows and skin is not from Too Faced. Those are from other companies, but it is mainly a Too Faced tutorial, so if you'd like to see how I got this smoky kind of neutrally eye, this bold pink lip, and this contour then just keep watching. So I'm starting off with the Lorac behind the scenes eyeshadow primer to keep my eyeshadow in place and prevent creasing. Next I'm taking an H&M eye color to go eye pencil in the color fairy tale and putting this all over my lids as a base and blending it in with my finger. It's a really pretty creamy pencil that's gonna help keep your eyeshadow in place, boost the color, and they're a new product to me and I'm kind of obsessed with them. I'm taking the Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette from Too Faced and I'm using the color Butter Pecan on a MAC 239 brush all over my lid. This is just a really pretty sparkly lid color and you guys know I love my sparkly glittery lid colors but it's a really nice neutral kind of yellow gold and I just think it is such a pretty color. It's one of my favorites from the palette. Then same palette going back in with a duo two shades. I'm putting a mix of nougat and rum raisin on a MAC 2. 17 brush and blending that into my crease. I am really focusing on the outer V area and using small circular motions combined with windshield wiper motions. The last shade I'm using from this palette is the Cocoa Chili shade and we're going to use this to deepen up the outer V crease area and I'm still using the exact same 217 brush just to get a really nice blend on those colors and make it all very smooth and transitional and really really pretty gradient. Now to tightline, I'm taking the Marc Jacobs Highliner Gel Crayon in Black Cure. I like to tightline to give my lashes a bit of a fuller effect without eyeliner, then obviously curling the lashes. And I'm using two different types of mascara, both from MAC, and the first one is the Mineralize Multi-Effect Lash in Charred Black to get a really full, voluminous lash, and that's just coated on the top. And then following up with that, I'm using the Studio Sculpt Super Black Lash, which has a really cool bristle brush that works really well to get your lower lash line as you can see and comb through the first mascara to make sure everything is really nice and spread out and pretty looking. It's my new favorite combo right now. I really really like it. To conceal the blueness under my eyes, I'm using the MAC Studio Conceal and Correct Duo in the color Pale Yellow, and then while that's setting and kind of like drying a little bit, I'm taking the MAC Match Master Concealer in 1.0 and putting that on any blemishes that I have. And then for the yellow concealer, I pat that in with my finger because I feel like that gives a nicer application. And then I'm going in with the Match Master Concealer and using a MAC 130 brush to blend that all in. I've been really enjoying this concealer. It's really, really creamy and it's kind of replacing foundation for me. And to set it all, of course, you know I'm using my MAC Studio Fix in NW10. The powder is my favorite and I'm using it with a MAC 167 Special Edition brush, but this is a permanent brush in their line. As usual, I'm using my Benefit Gimme Brow in Medium Deep to set my brows, give them a little bit of shape and kind of tame them into place. My favorite product for brows, I think, ever. Next, I'm going in with my Too Faced Little Black Book of Bronzers, and I'm using the Chocolate Soleil Medium Deep Bronzer with a MAC 168 Special Edition brush. Again, this is just special because it was a Christmas collection, but they have this brush all the time, which is one of my favorite for contouring because it does have a really great angle to it, and it's slightly dense and slightly fluffy. I'm obsessed. 
For blush, I'm using the Too Faced Love Flush Blush in Justify My Love. This packaging is everything, top of the powder is everything, but I'm using a MAC 120 brush to pop this on my cheeks and a little goes a long way for my highlight, I'm using the Too Faced Candlelight Glow Highlighting Powder Duo on that same MAC 130 brush, and I like to do a little mixture of both of them. I think this is such a pretty highlight. And I'm using a Too Faced Melted Liquefied Longwear Lipstick. I'm sad because I don't have the same colors, you guys, unfortunately. I'm using Melted Candy, which I couldn't find at Sephora and I wanted to get you, but I got Melted Strawberry for the giveaway because that felt a little more Valentine's with the chocolate and the strawberry. They're both very pretty and appropriate for Valentine's Day, mine being a bright pink and yours being a true classic red. I'm actually allergic to strawberries, so I didn't really want to take any chances with getting the strawberry melted liquid lipstick. So since I can't have it, I'm very happy that one of you guys will be winning it. So that was the makeup tutorial for this look I'm wearing right here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And like I said, if you've made it this far throughout the video and you're still not subscribed, button is right down there. I'd be so happy if you subscribed. Also, all of my social media links are in the down bar as well. I would love it if you came and followed me on those so we can chat and connect. And in the down bar as well is my blog post, which has all the products I used in this tutorial and links for where you can find them if you want to buy them yourself and all the brushes I used in the tutorial as well. So if you're curious, about any of those they will all be on the blog which is also the first link in the down bar the giveaway video is also linked in the down bar as well and yeah I think I think that's it I feel like I haven't filmed for a while and I'm a little bit rusty but I think I covered all my bases so yeah and I think that's going to be it for today's video I hope you're having a great day whenever you're watching this and I will see you in my next one bye it's Claudia. So as you can see by the title below, I have a huge Too Faced Cosmetics giveaway. This is going to be for Valentine's Day. So